people let your girl Adiola. Are you normal? Are you okay? Is everything right here? Because I don't have your time today. Forgive me, my people. What is going on with the medulla oblongata of your brain? <laughs> and who is that, by the way, that you played? Sorry. Is that a pastor? <laughs> Ah, but Jesus, you see, these pastors have started. Hey, what are these people turning the church into campaign arenas of what? Ah, for that. Like I was saying, let me go back to the beginning, which I mean, what's up, my people, is your girl. Thank you so much for the well wishes after I talked about us battling COVID. I really appreciate you guys. For some reason, some people said I was lying, I wouldn't have COVID. I'm like, why would anybody? <laughs> Anyway, before I forget, is it true that voters' card PVC expires in Nigeria? They may not announce to you on time. The PVC you have has expired. Yes. 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 I don't understand. Why then do they call it PVC, permanent voters' card? Huh? Hmm? He shaking me. Speak loud, do. Ah, don't you more son? No. He ah. You don't mean it. Jesus. Tirubu apologizes over statement on expired PVC. <laughs> but he made that such a bold statement publicly. Ah ah. Hey, hey, me. Ah ah. Look at it. PVC trouble. Why? But why? 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 Eh? If you don't know something, must you? Because this thing can cause people to register twice, which will cause confusion. Eh? Double registration is an offense under the Nigerian law. No be so. Ah ah. I don't understand because according to INEC, once a name appears on the National Register of Voters, it says there permanently. That is why they call it permanent what? Voters card. But the people surrounding him were agreeing with him, especially the madam in the front. <laughs> Look at that. Instead of correcting him. The PVC you have has expired. Yes. 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 You need to spread it around in various local government wards. It's alright, it's alright. I think we need to move on because there's real news that I want us to talk about. But uh, either way, this coming election is going to be very interesting. So, what is the first story on the agenda today? Tinubu donates 50 million naira to Niger State to help tackle insecurity. Guys, just please give me one minute. I just want to settle something with Corridor. It won't take long. Guys, and uh, Raf or somebody, please cut this part. They don't need to see it. Where's my where's my shoes? Something. Why are you going? Come here. No, no. Just stay, stay right. Mm -hmm. You think I'm playing with you? Seriously, you just enjoy interrupting my... What is this? I said this, we're not talking about Tinubu today, but everything has been Tinubu, Tinubu, what? Tinubu? Exactly what did you eat this morning? Kini, Kini, Soro, Regongo. Kini, Mbaoja. What is fighting with you inside your spirit? This is not a Tinubu episode. How many times do I need to say it? Everybody has heard me. Can we talk about more important things? Where has the man been all this while that the insecurity has been ravaging in Naya State, in different parts of Nigeria? Where has it been? is making donations. You think we don't know this has something to do with the coming election? Get out. Are you alright? You guys can turn the camera back on. It's okay. Are we live? We are live, huh? Okay, I like you. I like you. In case you are watching, sir. I like you. I told you, Tinubu. I was just telling Koyedo that you are a very generous somebody. I mean, look at how the man is giving left and right, left. In fact, last year, in case some of you did not get it, this same man donated another 50 million naira to the people of Katsina State. Kat, not Lagos, not anywhere in his region. In fact, he went to see them in Katsina State after that fire that happened at the Katsina Central Market, you know. So, which is a very good thing. I'm very happy for the people of Katsina. 50 million 
Nigerian Nara. It is not a joke. So that they will be able to rebuild their what their market. We need their votes in this coming election, I beg. Hopefully, though, Daddy, as well, you, in case you are watching my father, hopefully you will also be able to donate something for the victims of uh, Sasha Market, the one that burned down in uh, Ibadan. You know, Ibadan, next door to Lagos. Eh? <laughs> you know, I do have my father. All the PAs of my father, I call you because you may not be aware that uh, next to Lagos, so a market burned down <laughs> in Ibadan like that. Maybe you can also donate something for the victims of the Lekki Gate shooting. The family members of the young people, protesters that were killed while they were protesting at Lekki Gate. I'm sure he knows <laughs> where Lekki Gate is. So maybe he can also donate something for them as well. He's a very generous somebody is what I'm trying to say. I'm very sure he just, maybe he forgot or something <laughs> that uh, there was a shooting at Lekki Gate. And speaking of young people, I'm just so glad that uh, we already know my father's plan for young Nigerians if he should become the president of Nigeria. And we are, comp we are competing with our robbers and the bandits to recruit from the youths who are unemployed. 33% unemployed. Recruit 50 million youths into the army and the, uh, what they will eat? Cassava, uh, Agbado, uh, corn, and the mori, uh, yam. Wait, what? Did he just. Hey, boy. Yeah, he. You know, I'm suddenly very hot. Is it hot in here? Is it just me? Is it just me or it's very hot? Can you guys turn on the AC? Who the. Call it the wall? Did you turn off the AC? It's very hot. Ah, no, for real, I'm really, really hot. I don't know, maybe you guys. I, why is nobody else complaining? Are you okay? The AC is on. Are you alright? I'm alright. This is not on. Okay, no, it's on. Hold on, where are you going? Come here. No, no, just stay, stay right there. Okay, is that the AC is off or you guys played the wrong video? Sorry, guys. So he actually said that. Hold on. Okay, he clarified what he said. What kind of clarification? Let me see that. Can I see what he said? It's behind me. In a statement by his spokesperson today, Raman, on Tuesday night, he said it was an accidental verbal mistake. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> accidental verbal mistake. Okay. He is even worse. And then they said he disclosed that he meant 50,000 youths. Mm -mm, mm -mm. The man said 50 million youths. Abba, he knows what he's saying now. That you are going to be no as well you in case you are watching. Because now they are making it look like you don't know what you are saying. I hate what I don't like. Now you are making the man look like he's crazy. I like you know vex. You know it is my job to defend you. Let me, let me defend you once and for all. You didn't even say maybe he meant 5 million. How can you say 50,000? This was last year by the way. That is his plan for the unemployed Nigerian youth. He's definitely not talking about 50,000. No, 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 no. When there are millions of unemployed youth, how can he talk about 50,000? He wants to push them into the army. So, so why are his peers now making it look like he doesn't know what he's talking about? You cannot be doing my father like that. I like you. How can this be your plan for young Nigerians? It's what is breaking my heart right now. The Nigerian army is our destiny. Because now I'm starting to feel like Ogabuari, Tinubu, all of them, all the politicians, it's as if they see us young people like menace. How can you just dismiss us like that? The, the army, feed them cassava. Feed, ah, feed who cassava? My father, Emma Bino, is just a legitimate question. Ah, oh, we'll have more full leg again. Who do you want to be feeding? <laughs> Feeling me, see, ah, I like it, you know, and you, you are using bullion van to carry cash inside your house, inside your apartment. You want us to be eating cassava while we are fighting terrorists? This is all you see us doing? Ah, Jesus. Now, I'm getting upset. You guys don't like to get upset on my show, so let me not get upset. So he said this last year, they said it was a mistake. Now he's telling people that PVC will expire. Is my father okay? It's all I want to know. I like it, just cool temper, let me ask the question. Because I just want to know how we are supposed to pray, that is all. Just tell us how to pray. Because he just talked about dismissing about one quarter of the entire population of Nigeria, you want us to go into the army. The devil is a liar. Ah, let me talk. What's your problem? Let me talk. Oh, Jade. I just my wish. You successfully made this about Tinubu. You know, you just, by the way, you guys don't do this at home. 
including you watching me and everybody don't talk about why he's a very big somebody so you guys don't talk about him as you guys can see i'm also just praising him you know thanking him for his generosity so you guys be careful don't say anything bad you know i can never say anything bad about somebody like that don't say anything bad he's a big man eh? so what is the next story hey Ola, get back say the tagline my tagline oh um you guys not doing much guess what i'm just keeping it real.